Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Z Chocolato Fudge. This was sent to us from Shelby. So thank you very, very much, Shelby. Uh, Z Chocolato Fudge is a uh, San Francisco company. It says, let me see, I did a little bit of homework. Uh, Z Chocolato's Layered Fudge has been featured on the Cooking Channel's Unique Sweet Show and was also ranked in the top 25 of all shops in America. The fudge is made in small batches, only six pounds at a time, and is still made in a good old-fashioned baking pan just like you would at home. Their signature flavor is the peanut butter pie, which has seven oh, layers inside, including caramel, marshmallow, heath, Oreo, milk chocolate, and peanut peanut butter fudge. That sounds amazing. That sounds good. That sounds like um, a good mixture. Kevin makes an awesome peanut butter pie, but I can tell you right now. It, it's it, not in fudge form. And it doesn't have heath. <laughs> it doesn't have heath in it. Um, so we have, uh, uh, Shelby sent us six flavors to try. We have uh, peanut butter chocolate, and we're going to describe each one. Mm -hmm. We have chocolate Reese's Delight, chocolate caramel brownie, white tiger, salted caramel butterscotch and apple caramel cobbler fudge which is a limited edition one so the first one we're and going you to can try, really see the layers in that the one yes, called tiger or something white tiger that, you can really see the layers in that one. i love the name so the first one we're going to try is going to be the peanut butter chocolate because that seems like out of all these the, the most basic it's um, very soft it, it's as classic. What more can we say? Milk chocolate fudge layered on top of peanut butter fudge. This one's very soft. Like the top is like fudge, like traditional fudge, but the peanut butter part is very uh, soft. Soft. Mm. I love that peanut butter, uh, the texture of that peanut butter. I could always put that kind of peanut butter on a sandwich. I know. I'm wondering. <laughs> super sweet peanut where, butter. Yeah, where has this peanut butter been on my life? Well, it's because like they've taken peanut butter and mixed it with a little bit of like powdered sugar. Yes. And thickened it up a little bit. It's, it's, it's. Oh, it's so good. It's not just creamy. It's like silky. Mm -hmm. It's. Um, yeah, they've, they've really done a good job. Yes. And it's a very, very sweet. And, and the chocolate, really, the chocolate is like an afterthought because the star of that show is the peanut butter, but it is delicious peanut butter. I tried just a piece of the chocolate. The chocolate by itself is good. It's good. It's, it's very light. It kind of tastes like a chocolate frosting, like a cake frosting. It's overshadowed, though, by that peanut oh, butter. Oh, the peanut butter is the star. Yeah. <laughs> so now That's we're going to try good. the chocolate Reese's Delight. It is a Reese's peanut butter cup. But twice as nice. And you can see the Reese's cup, like the ridges and yes. stuff in there. Um, let's see. We layer our homemade milk chocolate fudge with peanut butter and Reese's peanut butter cups. That is different than the chocolate peanut butter one for sure. Mm-hmm. You really do get that Reese's peanut butter. You get the gritty. Flavor. Yeah, yes, and you, the get the, you get the flavor of the Reese's, but you also get the gritty grittiness of the Reese's peanut butter. Mm, that's very, very good. But honestly, I, the peanut butter is extremely strong, but I taste the chocolate too in mm -hmm. that. The chocolate comes through, and it's a Reese's chocolate. It's like yes. the traditional Reese's cup chocolate. That's what you taste. That is incredible. That's very, very good. Um, so out of those, just those two, which one would you be um, your I really, if I wanted just pure peanut butter, I would go for the chocolate peanut. I, I think it just depends on what kind of mood I'm in. I'm going to pick that Reese's. The Reese's is very, very good. They're both I do delicious. like the idea of tasting the chocolate. Yes, too. they're both delicious, but I want to pick the Reese's. Okay, what's this one? This is chocolate caramel brownie. That's what you said. It looks like it has brownie on top. Layered with flavor. Uh, la uh, you have caramel. Uh, and they, uh, it says, uh, we bake fresh brownies from scratch in our kitchen, add it to our creamy milk chocolate fudge, layer in caramel, and top it with another layer of chocolate brownies. Decadence in every bite. I'll tell you one. First of all, I love the texture of all these. That one's a little more of the traditional fudge grittiness, that sugary grit, mm -hmm. um, which I love. But it also has that brownie flavor. You can really taste that. That brownie really comes through as a brownie flavor. And the caramel. And the caramel. That's really good. Yeah, if you I like a chocolate fudge, that's a good chocolate fudge. It is. And it is, um, 
it's probably more the texture that you're used to. It's, it's a firmer, it has that firmer, grittier yeah, texture. It's firmer, but you can absolutely tell it's a brownie. You can taste that caramel. Mm -hmm. It's a very, very sweet. I think that one is probably sweeter than the two previous oh, ones yeah. just because it has so much going on. I agree. It's very, very sweet. It's delicious. Uh, delicious fudge. This one is called White Tiger. This layered beast What's has good? stripes of milk chocolate fudge, peanut butter, and caramel in between layers of vanilla fudge, all with a touch of sea salt. Ooh. That tastes more like what you consider like a traditional peanut butter fudge, like you'd make at Christmas time. Mm -hmm. That's what that tastes like to me. Except it's, it's got that vanilla coming through. That white part, mm -hmm. though, has the texture of, of a peanut butter roll. If you've ever yeah. eaten a peanut butter roll, made a peanut butter roll, it, it has that similar. texture. The whole I, thing kind of reminds you of a peanut of butter a roll. Of a peanut butter roll, yeah. yes. It tastes a lot like a peanut butter roll. Except that's better. Yeah, I don't that, get really the caramel coming through. I do get a little of the salt. But, but you get the that uh, that white. It's uh, what do you put in a peanut butter roll? You put lots of powdered powder sugar, sugar and cream cheese. And cream cheese. Yeah. yeah. So you're tasting that cream cheese powder sugar. Uh, Which you may not have any cream cheese in it at all. But it comes across. That but way. that's what it tastes. It tastes like a peanut butter roll, mm -hmm. and you're getting the peanut butter. I like the texture of that better than a peanut butter roll. <laughs> I like the texture of this better too because yeah. it has a traditional fudge texture. Mm -hmm. It's very, very, very soft. Yeah. Yes. And I, I always love the grittiness. The That's sugary incredible. Grit. Uh, this one, this one looks good. is called on Salted Caramel Butterscotch. Salted Caramel Butterscotch star started as a flavor of the month, but was also popular. Uh, so popular we get requests for it frequently. We mix butterscotch with our vanilla fudge before adding caramel, sea salt, and butterscotch morsels. So that's what that is on and top. And you can smell the butterscotch. Mm -hmm. For the video, I'm eating these a lot faster than I normally would. Normally I would let it sit on my tongue and just melt a little bit before I ate it. That, that is just wonderful. <laughs> I love butterscotch anyway. And that is like over the top sweet. That's like, yeah. I thought that tiger one was sweet. That's sweet. That butterscotch is over, I mean, just over the moon sweet. It's so good. And it tastes like, mm. um, if you've ever bought the hard candy butterscotch, yeah. the, it's really strong butterscotch. Mm -hmm. That is very strong. Yep. That absolutely does not disappoint. No, if you like butterscotch, get that. I think that's like sweeter than any milkshake. Yeah, it's um, <laughs> It is very, very sweet. Um, but it's delicious and creamy, but it has that little bit of grit to it, and you do get the little texture from the pieces, the chips on mm -hmm. top. Yeah. Um, it's, it's good. This last one is Apple Caramel Cobbler Fudge. The smell of fall is in the air, and with that comes fresh baked apple cobbler. That was the inspiration for our newest fudge flavor. This uses apple cider fudge mixed with fresh caramel, dried apple uh, by, uh, bits, plus a brown sugar crumble topping. The crumble topping is still soft. Um, it looks like it has like crust on it, but it's really, it's a soft uh, crust. Um, that is apple pie to me. Or maybe, I mean, apple cobbler, apple pie. Um, it, it's got cinnamon. It's got that, that good apple, sweet brown sugar kind of apple. Not a tart apple. It's got like a sweet apple. There, That's good. I think there are some, some people have told me I can't handle really, really sweet things. I don't know if you this, can eat any of this these. This would make your head explode <laughs> yeah, it because be. it is over the top sweet. Mm -hmm. this is, I think that's the softest one too, except for maybe the peanut butter one. This is the kind of fudge where you're not going to be able to sit down and eat the entire block of it no. because it is so very, very sweet. You would get sick. Yeah. I, just eating the pieces that we've had right here, I feel full. Yes. Oh, yes. And like I'm, I'm satisfied with the amount of sweet I've had. Yes. I mean, of course I could. I could eat more. Could uh, and want to. My eyes and, and you, my heart tells me I want to eat more of that. Uh, but you know you shouldn't because you're going to be sick if you do. Yeah. 
Um, I think this would be wonderful if you were to pick, um, first of all, all these are excellent. Yes. This is like some of the best fudge that I've Ever. had. Ever, yes. Because um, most fudge is, is more denser and harder. Yes. This is very, very soft, melt on your tongue kind of fudge. I this mean, is not what you find alcoholic. at, at, we have reviewed fudge in the past on the yeah. channel. This does, there's not even a comparison. No, no, even one of our favorite fudges. Is, it, this is apples this is and not oranges. Compared you cannot even this, compare it. And no. the flavors of these are so much better than the other one we liked, which I don't want to mention names. No. But there's another one, if you look on our channel for fudge, you'll see a bunch of it. Um, that's a harder, not quite as flavorful fudge. This mm -hmm. is like over the top. Yeah, sometimes the what it's called, the flavor doesn't come through. Right. Whereas everything they've said about these comes through. Yeah, yeah you get All some those aspect flavors of it. just a pop. Yeah. Um, I think this would be cool is if, if you, because um, we used to, when we go to Disney, we always buy fudge. And yes. we'll sit in the bed at night before we go to bed and just share fudge. Yes. Share the flavors. I'll get pick a flavor, Tammy will pick a flavor, yeah. and we'll, we'll interchange and share up. This would be awesome for a family to have like a little tasting party. Yes. You know, everybody pick their own flavor out, get it get it yeah. home, and then um, share it. Yes. To everybody. Yeah, that let the kids awesome. get on the website, let the kids pick out, each one of them gets to pick out a piece. And then when you get it, try uh, everybody try some. Yeah. Nobody's allowed to get the same thing. No, 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 you <laughs> yeah. can't get two you have Reese's. To get, that's right. You have to get. And no matter how much you're tempted, you can't get the same. Yeah. Uh, now, these are excellent, and, and I don't know how much they cost per pump, I don't but, either. I but do. They're very, very good. I can tell you it's free nationwide shipping if you spend over $25. Which you're going to do. So, over $25, free shipping, all order shipped from our kitchen in two to three business days as we make our fudge fresh daily. Um, I thought this was cool on the website. They offer Zoom chocolate making yeah, uh, Like classes. Zoom, the computer program Zoom. Yes, like so like classes. in our times of COVID, uh, you can learn how to make chocolate online. That's I cool. think that's cool. Um, they also offer, not only do they have fudge, they also have chocolate and candy. So they have like saltwater taffy, they have peanut butter cups, they have like uh, s'mores, Heath Caramel Sticks. There's a whole tab. If you go to um, zchocolato.com and they have a whole, uh, the tabs at the top are easy to use and you can click on it. So they have more besides the fudge. But the thing about their fudge is they, um, it says we frequently rotate our flavors. Subscribe to our newsletter for flavor updates. So they, this is a page That's potential for, flavors. Right. So right now on the website, for example, they might only have, let's say, 15. It, it might be more or less. I'm just throwing out that number. They're going to change those up all the time. And if you're subscribed to the newsletter, they'll let you know, hey, the pumpkin's out now if you want to order the pumpkin. Uh, but they do have uh, pumpkin and they have all kinds uh, caramel cookie dough and cookies and cream cougar butter seven layer peanut I don't know butter if cougar pie. butter is like a um... cougar butter is mocha fudge peanut butter and caramel oh I would have thought it would have been that um, like Nutella or the Biscoff or they have butter. a uh, raspberry chocolate swirl they have a peanut butter uh, dulce de leche they have a Heath caramel they coffee they need to do one with biscotti that would be awesome. Um, if you haven't done one, you should do one. I do not see one Because on that would here. be, can you imagine that flavor in there? You're like, talking about Biscoff. Biscoff. He no, didn't mean to say Biscotti. Biscotti. He meant uh, the Lotus. The spread. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't see that on here. That would be a good one to try because it's yes. so good. Yes, it is absolutely amazing. Um, well, these are good. Yes, if you only had the money. To pick one? To pick one. I don't know. I'd have to be a two. <laughs> now, if okay. I only picked one, no, 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 pick you, one, I'd pick the butterscotch one. And I would pick the white tiger. Yeah, the, uh, the white tiger is very that good. That white tiger See, is. See, I so would sweet. probably do butterscotch. Honestly, the apple's pretty good in the brownie one. Those would be if my you like those three. three. Yeah. Um, the vanilla in this, the you know, they said that it has a, a vanilla uh, fudge, but it tastes like what people would consider a birthday cake. Mm -hmm. And they do have one called birthday cake. So I wonder how close it is to these mm -hmm. because it tastes just like birthday cake. It's delicious. If I had to pick three of this group, I would pick the White Tiger, the Reese's, um, the uh, 
Chocolate Reese's Delight, and I would pick the one that you did, the butterscotch. The butterscotch. Salted caramel butterscotch. So we'd be fine over the butterscotch ones. <laughs> you you guys just have to get your own. <laughs> um, but these these are absolutely delicious. If you go visit their website, of course, we won't know. We don't get anything out of it. Uh, Shelby was just kind enough to uh, send these to us. Uh, I'm glad she did. I'm very, very glad she did because this is something that I would be uh, proud to, to send to a family member. If you have family in another state and you don't know what to send them, yeah, send them a, a box birthday of this. gift of this. That'd be an awesome birthday gift. Oh my gosh. I would love this for a birthday. I, me too. <laughs> At any time, yes. Yeah. I, I would be absolutely thrilled with this. So let us know if you've ever had anything from a Z Chocolato. What is your favorite flavor? And thank you again to Shelby and thanks for watching.